Welcome back to Ghost Hired Entertainment. I'm your host, Kanan Becker, and today we do June's Horror Pack unboxing. And real quick before we get into this unboxing, if you could do me a favor and hit that like button because that really does help this channel out so much. All right guys, so today we're doing June's Horror Pack unboxing. And for those of you not familiar with what Horror Pack is, Horror Pack is a monthly Blu-ray or DVD subscription where for just $19.99 or $24.99, depending on which one you want, you can get four Blu-ray or four DVD shipped to your house. They're horror, of course. You get them shipped to your house once a month. And so I go through and I open this up and we go through them together. So it's just a fun thing that we do on this channel every month. But if you're interested in getting your own horror pack, there's a link down in the description. And if you go through and sign up through that link, it saves me a few dollars as well as saves you a few dollars. And with that, let's get into this box. So grab out my trusty knife and get into this bad boy. So I hope you guys are all doing well out there in the horror family universe. I got big plans for this week. Gonna go see The Purge this weekend and post up a review for you guys. So that should be a lot of fun. But I love how they double pack this. I always talk about that and I swear I always knock over something behind me. This time it was Michael Myers. So let me fix that real quick. Because you just can't have Michael Myers laying on his back. Disrespecting poor Michael. Oh, and last time I think I got my uh, Cthulhu. So this time I got Michael. But anyway, <laughs> I always throw a thing randomly and I swear it all said something. Anyway, so yeah, so we go through this. I reach in, grab one out, pull it out, and we talk about it for a second and then move on to the next. That's what we do. So the first one we have is Spare Parts. What have you done to me? It's okay. Chosen. Chosen. Not super familiar with uh, what this is. It does sound familiar, but it says in a god forsaken bar in the middle of nowhere, an all girl band, Miss 45, rips the stage apart with their pink spirit. But their performance impresses an enthusiastic fan who lures the girls into a trap. He sedates them and starts customizing them. Ooh, that does not sound fun. Slowly they begin to gain consciousness and in a total shock realize their arms have all been replaced with axes and chainsaws to fight gladiator style in a junkyard arena owned by a sadistic emperor forcing them into the battle of their lives with one prize in mind, their freedom. That sounds like it could be either very horrific or a really good time. I don't know. If you guys have heard of this movie, let me know in the comments. I always love hearing what you guys think of these because I don't end up getting to watch a lot of them. I do watch some of them, but I don't get to watch a lot of them. So anyway, sounds interesting. Show's not a show without a little bit of blood, am I right? Fuck yeah. Spare parts. All right, now let's reach in here for the next and let's see what that is. And it is the Poltergeist Diaries. I need help. My brother disappeared. His name is Jacob Taylor, please. Please help us. And it looks like it's the Horror Pack exclusive, which is a cool thing that Horror Pack does because this is the only place you could basically get the Horror Pack exclusive. They're kind of low rent movies. They're not like high budget or anything, but still they, they support small movie makers. And I just love that. But it, uh, it basically says, after moving to an isolated cabin, Jacob Taylor vanishes without a trace. With the help of footage, he leaves behind his family members and friends and a detective, sorry my eyesight's crappy, try to find answers to the strange events that are centered around him. So, I don't know. It doesn't really say a whole lot about it and it doesn't really show a whole lot about it. So, <laughs> I don't know. But that is it. Let's move to the next. A lot of times I haven't heard of a lot of these movies. A lot of them are just kind of lower, you know, obscure type of movies, but some of them are hidden gems. Like uh, last horror pack, I got Ascent, and I told some of you I would uh, talk about it. Um, I will probably do a review on it at some point, but it was a pretty cool movie. It had some very cool special effects. It dealt with a lot of like psychological stuff. Just very cool movie. Um, I definitely recommend checking that one out for yourself. I think it's on Shudder. 
It's definitely on Tubi, but it might also be on Shutter. All right, next one up, Gwen. Bless us, O oh Lord, for these gifts for which we are about to receive. We pray too for our dad. Keep him from harm away in the fighting. Now, this is a movie I keep meaning to check out. It is on Shudder, and I've heard a lot of really good things about it. So now this is like, you know, cuts out all the excuses I have. I need to watch it now. Um, but yeah, I've heard it's very cool, so I don't know. It says, Gwen is a young girl whose life seems to be collapsing around her, struggling with her mother's mysterious illness, her father's absence, and a group of angry villagers trying to take her farm. Gwen must find the strength to guide her family through the darkness. But as a malevolent presence begins to take grip of her home, it becomes apparent that there is a greater evil that may be too strong to overcome. So, I don't know. Like I said, I know it's on Shudder, and I have heard that it's a very good movie. And I am a big fan that it also has a slip cover. Love that. But so far, all the Shudder movies that I have gotten, the Shudder exclusives that I have gotten through, Horror Pack have been really good. So hopefully this is another one. Bob? I never meant to hurt you. I only ever wanted to protect you. All right, and then last up, but not least, we have whoop, 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 Child's Play. Can we open my presents now, Mommy? A good guy! I knew it! <laughs> I, I'm Chuck. What the fuck? Which Child's Play is this? Is this the original? This is the original, but look at this badass cover, dude. I've never seen this cover of Child's Play. This is super dope. I have it on DVD, but I don't have Child's Play uh, Blu-ray, and it's got a bunch of special features. Like, this is super cool, man. Look at all those special features it has, all the bonus features. But this is crazy. Like, I had never, ever seen this cover. And it looks like it's even got an artist signature, so it's like an exclusive um, limited edition type of edition. So that's super awesome. But I'm sure you guys all know uh, what Child's Play is. And if you've never heard of Child's Play, you need to go watch it because Chucky's like one of the OGs, man. One of the, the horror Mount Everest heads or not Mount Everest, blah, blah, blah. Mount Rushmore. He's one of the Mount Rushmore heads. Like, you know, he's one of the horror kings. I love Chucky. And the cool thing is they're coming out with a TV series, which you might not have heard of, on uh, the Sci-Fi channel. And it's going to be taking place. Basically, it's going to take off right where the last Chucky Child's Play movie left off. Not the newest Child's Play bullshit remake, reboot, whatever the fuck you want to call that. Not that. It's going to take off from this franchise, this uh, Chucky that we know and love. It's going to be a series taking off from there. So I'm really excited to see that too. Should be very very cool i know the little clips and little things i've heard about it so far it's gonna be very very cool and a lot of fun to watch so i like this pack this is a cool one i mean like i'm really stoked about the child's play especially because of that exclusive cover like that cover is just so wicked like i love that art i mean i'm an artist i, I do this channel but you know i've done art forever so i love art and then i'm stoked about gwen because i love shutter so much and I'm always down to have Shutter exclusives, especially on Blu-ray. Curious about this? You know, it's hard to know if these are good or not. Sometimes they're actually pretty good. And then this sounds fun. This might either be a bullshit movie or like something that's really actually really fucking cool. Because it just sounds like completely off the wall, bonkers, batshit crazy, which I love. I mean, that can be like some of the most fun movies sometimes. So We'll see. But that's it for today. Thank you so much for hanging out and checking this out. Please leave your comments down there because I love hearing from you guys. Love hearing suggestions from you always. It's just cool to, you know, gabber back and gabber, gabber. I don't know. <laughs> Talk words to each other back and forth down in there. Um, so, yeah, so do that. 
And also, if you could do me a favor and hit that subscribe button and ding that little bell, because that is the best way to keep track of this channel. And when I post videos like this, and I try to post videos like this at least, usually three times, but at least two times every week. And I also want to give a huge, massive, enormous thank you to my patrons, because you're so important to me and you've been growing so much lately and i'm just so proud of of that community that we're building over there and if you would like to find out more about becoming a patron the link is also down in the description and don't forget if you want to get your own horror pack the link is down there as well and it'll save you a few dollars if you go through there and it really helps me out makes me look good and helps me save a few dollars because i still have to pay for these myself too and like always thank you so much for watching please crush that like button and remember guys horror can be fun i will see you guys next time